Dr. Jellin, a, a term is used a lot today, I think called acid reflux, a GERD. What is that, and can a baby be born with it? Most babies, in fact, do reflux. By that, it me we mean that contents of the stomach reflux or are returned back into the esophagus and often are expelled from the mouth. This is actually quite normal for many infants. It can be troublesome and messy, but it still can be normal and not of any major significance. It does become of significance when the infant is not gaining weight appropriately, when the infant is feeding poorly, when the infant is uh, having major, is very irritable, or having major respiratory symptoms. Can they get a pneumonia from this? Yes, in fact, they can get pneumonia and because they aspirate or the uh, refluxed material goes down into the trachea or the windpipe. Sometimes kids are labeled asthmatic and yet we send it to a gastroenterologist. Why does that happen? It happens because when they aspirate, they can have some wheezing and appear to be asthmatic. Also, there are certain reflexes where acid in the esophagus will in fact cause bronchoconstriction or wheezing. So many times we have to check that out, not only take care of an asthmatic, make sure they don't have a reflux that makes the, either the asthma exaggerate or it be the cause. We look at children who have persistent wheezing that, that is um, not responsive to the usual asthmatic medications. And in those, cases, in those cases, it is quite appropriate to consider that reflux may be contributing to the symptom.